Oh my god! I'm not ready for this. So, what has been bestowed upon me? On my uh, YouTube homepage. It's this absolute beauty right here. That It's a channel called CBBC. And as you can tell by the title, it's exclusive. It's an exclusive... It's an exclusive moment. I'd say we're, we're a bunch of VIPs. Today, we are going to check out 20 years of CBBC in five minutes. I tell you what, 20 years old. Uh, it, it, it's come too fast. It has. And I think that uh, comes for every 20 year old ever. Like, what the hell? You know, one day you're just sitting there before the four school. Tracy Beaker comes on. You're like, oh, yeah. This is my smoothie right here. Fuck breakfast. I, I don't need breakfast. I I'm going to watch some CBBC in the morning. That that'll, um liven me up so yeah i always do that what else was there there was blood wolf i don't know something about a wolf yeah you're tracy b tracy b just stands out the most because it was just such an iconic and such a throwback oh my god you've got news round with ore oh, that man is so goddamn beautiful i amazing he really was do you guys remember dick and dom well and it, i i was always magnetized over fucking bogeys oh that shit got me going <laughs> The serious business in hand. Bogies! That was a brave bogey. I, I was, what was I? I must have been 13 at the time. <laughs> That's seven years ago, man. Well, what I was trying to say was Dom's on TikTok now. He's making DIY videos. Go, go give him a follow on TikTok. All right, then. Should we cry? Let's do it. Three, two, one. Let's get into this. This looks so goddamn new. <laughs> Oh my. 2002, 2002, get the hell away from me. All right, I'm ready for this. The O2 people, boys and girls, let's freaking go. Yeah. Afternoon, I'm Adrian. And I'm Angelica. Wait, yeah. We'd like to welcome Thank Mr. Dixon to the afternoon. Thank you very much. Thank you, Miss Bell. I don't know them. <laughs> That's so awkward because I just built this up as if, like, I'm just going to see Arthur. I, I think that was an American show, but it, I mean, it was on CBBC as well. Every day when you're walking down the street and everybody that you meet oh, get along with each other. Oh, I love it. I don't know who these are. Yes, it's Eureka Monday today. Yeah, we've got some experiments with papers. So stay tuned for that. Yes, but oh. first it's time to ask. And today they pay tribute to the opera Elwood City. It's very oh, good. Can I pay tribute as well? Yes. Singing opera. Oh, please do. That'd be great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo! Let's fucking go. Ah. I'll be someday. Be Peter. I always thought that guy looked like Mark Zuckerberg. This is news round. Woo! Raven. <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> to you too. Hello, I'm Anne and this is the CBBC channel and look what I'm going to put on your telly. <laughs> oh my god. No way. <laughs> sports round. I forgot there was a sports round. I don't know. Was this the bout with Ori? I can't, I can't remember which part was in Ore, but I just remember Ore. Oh, what a man. It's my mm -hmm. So this was the stuff, because there was a lot of parts of CBBCs still running to this day. But they've always had a knack for putting on the best segments of TV when I'm in school, right? So I'd be, I'd be in primary school and, you know, on the off day, I was sick. I, I was a good child. You know, I, I, I got my head in the books. I, I do suck at academics, but that, that's a whole different issue. On the, on the off chance, I would be sick. You know, stomach churning, rumbling, stay home. And when that happens, my God, did they have the best TV shows. No one could compare compete with them. I mean, I'd rather watch CBBC at this point but, uh, than the Olympics, okay? I think I did at one point. I just, I think I was upstairs and I was just, I just heard like a hundred meter run and I'm just listening to Tracy Beaker. Good little situation. Anyway, it was stuff like this. I never randomly come on. Oh, and then I'd go on Channel 4 and watch Simpsons. I, like I had a little ritual where, well, my mum for some reason made me do it. Because I guess the only way I could, my mum could cooperate 
with me to get a shower. You know, I, I was a, I was, a, I was a boy. You know, I, I'd screw a shower. You're vulnerable in the shower. No, no, I'm kidding. But <laughs> my mom had this thing of letting me watch one episode of Simpsons, and it came on every single day at 7 p.m. Because my bedtime was 9 p.m. Yeah, so to get me in the shower, she'd let me watch one episode of Simpsons, and that was on Channel 4. But that's just a little insight into just the different parts of my childhood, I suppose. <laughs> Oh my god, the foxes! Oh, I don't even feel like I'm overplaying it. It's oh, it's just these little transitions. They literally made it so sentimental. Oh, the nostalgia. They literally put nostalgia in the goddamn tags. Because <laughs> they know that they've brought up a generation of people. Obviously, people are now missing out because, you know, YouTube's taking over, TikTok's taking over, Instagram, everything. Everything is influencing people who are soon to be, well, I guess in the same time gap as me starting to watch CBB to being the age that I am now. Obviously, this this program, this CBBC, shaped my life. And for the better, I hope. Yeah. Oh, the sheep! Show the sheep. Da -da -da. Hey, hello again. Happy 2008. <laughs> uh, I've given up cake for New Year. Oh, oh, terrible God. idea. What are you doing? <laughs> You're writing to Colin Actus <laughs> about the outro <laughs> annual this year. <laughs> right, well, what's wrong with it? <laughs> There wasn't one. Oh. And MI9. It's so lit. MI9! No! Get it out of here! Oh, wow. MI, not MI9, MI high, sorry. <laughs> it says it right there. Ed and Outro. It was, I reckon it was from 2007, because I was, I was five years old at that point. And I think that's when my mum was like, right, I've had enough of you. I'm going to stop wiping your ass. You can now sit in front of the TV. So that's what I did for the rest of my life. Yeah, and must I? create a new breed of skilled undercover agent. There was one. Oh, which which episode was it? And it's so distinct for me. There was one where the guy. I don't know the guy's name. It's been a while, alright? It's been a while. Where he had this like patch on him or something, and it made him like this superhuman. I don't know what was going on. Maybe no. Maybe it was something else. Maybe it was Sarah Jane Adventure. Sarah Jane Adventures. <gasps> Oh my god! Ah! This is not a fairy tale. Come ah! on the game. If you want to take the tower on, you'll have to say his name. It's Wiley Sneak, Wiley Sneak, Wiley Sneak. But. Sean the Sheep. It's Sean the Sheep. He even mucks about with those who cannot bleed. I'm on a mission to find the deadly sick. Steam back, Sean! Oh! Fudge me. Ah, oh, I love a bit of sleep back. I don't know what he's doing nowadays. I really don't. I hope he's alive. I hope he's doing well. You know? Just saying. Steve, as 60 deadly creatures. Mm. Terrible Judas, gorgeous Georgia, slimy Stuart, small Victorian, woeful wars, ferocious fights, stingy castles. Very nice. Oh, it's oh, okay. over me. It's Ian off Taylor. Oh, it's you in it. And yeah, it's me. I'm, I'm back from my holidays. Yeah. I know you might notice something a bit different. Oh, what's that then? It's not. <laughs> so I just have my hair done. We're in a brand new CBBC office. Okay. Oh, wait, yeah, look at it gleam like a majestic waterfowl. <laughs> See, there's the proof. Completely with new sound effects there. Uh, we have moved to the Salford Keys, and if you look at this window, uh, no expenses spared, you can see in the distance the fantastic city of Manchester, which is real. Heaven's hat! Heck is hat! What was it? Heck is hat! Okay, uh, it literally said it on the screen thread. And then, oh, what was there? There was four o'clock club, weren't there? Around this time. Thank you. This! This is it! I wanted to be... This was like... I never watched Twilight, so this was the next best thing. Okay, well, I don't know. I wasn't a fucking preteen girl. All right, I'm sorry, but this i wanted to be a goddamn wolf so badly whatever it is it it created a spell on me and also i wanted to copy their like i guess edginess and this is probably my first insight into edginess kind of lifestyle i don't know how to explain it it was something about the drip i i no. all right hang on what is this called again wolf blood <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, which one was it? Bro, the biggest crush. Oh, my. This was, like, my first, like, I guess, supposedly celebrity crush. I, d I don't know who she is anymore. What's her name? Amy Kelly? Okay. And, and whoever this guy was, I wanted to be him so badly. Uh, uh it was, it's kind of, kind of embarrassing. I, I, I mean, I don't care. Maddie Smith, that was it. I wanted to be them so badly. Ah! <laughs> Let's go. Oh. 
Good Friday wind up. Oh, this man as well. Yep. Dumping ground. I forget. I, f I never saw that. Oh. Wait, is it, what, 2016 till now? When did I stop? I must have stopped watching CBBC around 2015, so I can't relate to this point. I don't think so anyway. CBBC. Yeah, no, I don't. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, <laughs> welcome to... It would be a bit awkward if I, if I kept watching CBBC at this point, wouldn't it? Is it... Would you guys be alright with that? Do I have your acceptance? Are you gonna be judgmental? No. Uh, <laughs> Alright, we've got a minute left. I possibly don't have a clue what they're gonna go on about. CBBC HQ! No, it's not oh, dazzling enough for me, so let's just do a little... Three, two, one, and... <laughs> Look at the mess! Wow. The humour is elite. Wow, that's much better and always convincing. <laughs> Check out no, our new I don't know who she is. headquarters. It looks amazing! Oh, yes, well, she really looks lovely. Nope, not a clue. What the hell are they? Oh, what's it turned into? No, no, now it's just going downhill. There was something so master masterpiece-nussfulness to it about how sh kind of crap the graphics were. And that was the beauty in it, right? Because, you know, you have, I like to call it, sh well, I just made it up. Shaun the Sheep graphics. Everything just looked like Shaun the Sheep, where you had like this just dated technology that is obviously now dated, but obviously not to a caveman. To a caveman, this is all like UFOs and shit. But now it just looks too clean. Now it looks too Disney+. Plus. It's going downhill in my opinion. It's getting too musical as well. I don't like musicals. Oh, it just looks too pristine. The Beaker Girls? What? Oh, get out of here, Doja Cat. What the fuck is that? The iPlayer, yeah. Let me just watch that. If there is like some merch, right? That I want, I want to buy some. Say if they did a merch line for this, I'd buy it. Honestly, I just want something to always be reminded of this. I'll get myself a tattoo going. Twenty years of CBBC. No, I wouldn't. Obviously not. Obviously not. But yeah, the memories, man. The memories. Let me comment down below your thoughts and feelings on this. I'm going to be really specific when I title this video. Only twenty-year-old UK people can watch. Is is that? Is that a bit too um, out there, or is that a bit? Too... Is that? I... Mm. But it is just so niche, right? There must have been tens of millions of children that watch this that are now my age, of course. I mean, if you wanted insight into Fred Dyslexic, that that's that's my YouTube channel name. Into my life, well, there you go. This was this was what I was brought up on, and if I'm to do another video like this, I'd probably cry because it's actually getting to me. Like my eyes are actually watering right now. I'm an emotional person. Right, chill out. And I'm using humor to not cry. Anyway, really hope you enjoyed this video. I just wanted to do it just out of pure spontaneousness. I'm a spontaneous person, so I, I just love shit doing shit like this. Hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, press a notification bell if you can and if you want to, because I'm all about. I'll see you in the next one. Oh yeah, I like to do a a secret word at the end of the video, just to let me know that you watched this far into the video. If you have watched this far into the video, the word of the video is ore. I don't know how to spell it. I'll put it there actually. Is it O R E? Ore? I don't know. It, it, it I, he's just I'm. I I hope he was there. There he is. There's ore. He's like the mascot of the video. All right, all right. I'll stop. I'll stop the video. All right. Um. Have, have a good day, everyone. Peace out. Have a good day. Bye now. Bye. 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 Bye.